it's reached its boiling point. We've had, en we've had enough, we need answers. Cindy Young says the latest COVID-19 update from Boone County Schools wasn't what she or her ninth grader son wanted to hear. What I fear is that our kids are gonna be competing for scholarships and getting into colleges with other kids that have had a full-time education this year. In an email Sunday, Superintendent Matthew Turner told parents to expect hybrid learning until moving to four days a week in March. That's to allow vaccinations to be fully effective. He says a push to four days of in-person learning in November was met with high COVID-19 cases and quarantines. CDC says they're allowed to, social distancing, uh, mask, they say it. We believe it. Parent Rick Klein says his son well, isn't getting the education he needs. We see Kenton County. We see schools within Boone County that are open. Why isn't Boone open? Sarah Cheek has three children in the district. Learning's been painful. It's been, you know, there's been tears and there has been uh, frustration both from my kids and from myself. These parents say in-person learning can work if the district wants it to. We need to hear from everybody. We need to hear from superintendent, the unions, Everybody's involved in this. What is keeping the kids out of school? Now, parents say there are a lot of inconsistencies they're coming across. They're talking a lot on social media about how some students are being allowed to learn one way while others are not able to. There's also a lot of screenshots that are being passed around. I tried to get in touch with the district today to try to verify some of those things and to try to interview them about all of this. But I was told that they either couldn't be found, they were in meetings, and then eventually the office was closed. We're live in Boone County. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5.